myself poonam sharma teacher at bethany convent school today i am i am going to tell you a lesson in evs my body my body you all have learned about the body parts in your previous lesson so before i start this lesson i want you all to play a game you all love to play game yes or no you all want to play games now so let's play a game before starting up with this lesson as we are going to play a game i'll tell you the instructions of this game you all have to touch only the body parts if i'll ask you to touch something else you are not supposed to touch that otherwise you will be out of this game i will say simon says touch your teeth so immediately you will touch your teeth but if i'll say simon says touch your table so you are not supposed to touch that so shall we start the game now simon says touch your ears simon says touch your nose simon says touch your skin simon says touch the wall simon says touch the window you all like the game with the help of your body parts you all have played this game so you can play at home with your family members also now we can start our lesson my body our body is a wonderful creation of god and our body has so many parts and all the parts of our body are very important all the body parts are very important you cannot do all the work with the help of one body part will it be possible for you to do with one body part no you need the help of other body parts also if you want to watch a cartoon you will use eyes as well as your ears so our body parts are helpful to us and we cannot use only one body part we need the help of other body parts also our hands help us to hold the things to clap you cannot clap with one hand na so you require both your hands to clap in the same way so many works we do with the help of our body parts now some parts are internal and some parts we can see outside can you see the hand you can see your ears all these are external organs all these organs are that we can see outside but some of the organs are inside our body we cannot see that organs can you see your heart no will it be possible for you to see your brain no with the so my dear students our body parts are of two types one are the internal organs and the others are external organs internal organs are the organs that are inside our body and external organs are the organs that are outside our body so now i'm going to give you again some examples with this help you will be able to understand in a more better way so now your eyes your nose your skin you can see these parts of your body so these are external organs and the organs that are inside your body which you cannot see are the internal organs you all have friends you all have friends you love to play with them in the same way god has blessed us with five friends they are our sense organs they are our sense organs they help us to see they help us to hear they help us to feel now can you see this this is an eye the first and the foremost sense organ is your eye we can see with the help of our eyes you god has blessed you with two eyes you all are having two eyes so eyes help us to see eyes help us to see you love to see cartoons you all love to see cartoons so with the help of your eyes you see cartoons in the same way this is a nose this is the second sense organs and with the help of this nose we smell we smell with the help of this nose you are having one nose or two nose 
we are having only one nose and with the help of this nose we used to smell we smell good fragrances if you want to smell the fragrance of a beautiful rose with the help of nose you can smell even the foul smell do you know the meaning of foul foul is bad smell now ear can you see this this is an ear ear help us to hear as i told you we are having five sense organs so the third sense organ is ear and ear help us to hear ear help us to hear now can you see this this is a tongue this is a tongue and the tongue help us to taste your mama prepares delicious food at home you love to eat you love to eat maggi na but how could you taste with the help of this tongue with the help of this tongue so tongue helps us to taste tongue helps us to taste now the last the last is skin the last is skin skin is also one of the sense organ and it is the it is the largest sense organ because the skin is covered in our whole body the skin is covered in our whole body you can see from top to the toe from head to the toe the skin is there so skin is the largest sense organ and we can feel with the help of skin if the iron is very hot and by mistake you touch that you feel so hot in the same way if the water is too cold so if you touch that you feel cold so with the help of skin we can feel the students sense organs help us to know the world around us we can see the beautiful scenery which is prepared by god which is made by god you can see the sun you can see the mountains you can see the sky with the help of your eyes with the help of your ears you can listen the sound if i clap you all have heard the noise so the sound of the clap you could hear with the help of your ears in the same way beta as god has blessed us with this life in the same way we are the beautiful creation of god we are the beautiful creation of god so we should take care of ourselves we should take care of ourselves we should eat healthy food we should take proper rest so that we should be active smart we should do exercises at home nowadays you cannot come out of your houses so you could do yoga exercises at home this we end our lesson hope you liked it